Hello there, let's see how to view a Tapo camera on a PC using VLC, which is a free software. It works with Mac or PC, doesn't matter, but specifically today I'm talking about PC, okay? So here I have a Tapo C100, but it works with any Tapo camera. Basically, you can just use VLC and connect to the camera, right? So just make sure that you have your Tapo camera connected to the same network as your computer is connected to and you have your cell phone, then you can set it up, all right? Let me just bring this camera here and then use my cell phone for the setup. So basically here, I just need to look for the Tapo app, which I have right here, and I have the Tapo C100 available. There we go. Make sure that's working. And then just come here to settings and look for advanced settings. I just check the network. So basically network settings in here, you can check to make a static IP address, right? So the router is giving the camera this IP address. I just want to make it static because I can use this later on VLC. So I just hit save here. Now I know the IP that I'm going to use. There we go. Then I come here to the camera account and enable the camera account, okay? Then I just come here to account information and I'm gonna give uh, the camera a name, a username that I'm going to use with VLC and a password. Uh, when you come here for the first time, the interface is a little bit different, right? I'm coming for the second time here because I was testing before. Then it's a little bit different, but either way, you're gonna enter the username and a password. We're gonna use this easy password just to test here and save. Then come back here to the camera, just see if it work. it's working fine. There we go, still working, pretty good. Now it's time to come here to the computer and use VLC. So here I have Windows, and I can just look for the VLC player. It's a free app you can download from the internet. And here I come to Media, Open Network Stream, or Control N on Windows. And here you need to type this RTSP column backslash backslash the IP of the camera and backslash again stream one. Okay. I already have it here because I was testing before. So that's the reason that I have here already. Just type that way and just hit play. And it's gonna ask you for the username and password that we put there. We put there top of cam and the password one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just hit okay here and it's connected, you see? So it's working pretty fine. We just test here. You see that works on the computer and on the phone at the same time, which is pretty good, okay? So basically working. So let's say you are using your camera. You can stream to your PC like this using VOC and leave here, for example, okay? And keep working if you want to. So pretty simple like this. The IP that you're using here is the IP of the camera, right? And it doesn't matter because here, when you have this IP for the camera, it's an internal IP. So if somebody sees your IP, let your, you can see mine here on, on this video, on the internet, it doesn't matter. It's an internal IP. There is no way somebody can uh, get into your camera using this IP because it's just an internal IP. So it doesn't matter, there's no problem, okay? Some, sometimes people ask me that about the IP, if I need to hide the IP or something, it doesn't matter, right? It works pretty fine, just internally here with your devices, right? So that's the way then you can connect your Tapo camera to a PC using VLC. I hope you liked this video, just leave your comments here and subscribe to the channel.